Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a daily vibes for December 27th. So, December 27th. We're just going to see whatever comes up. Go from there. May or may not be for you. This is for whoever it resonates with. December 27th. These all go upright, so. Mm. We have some self-love here, some self-love. There's some clarity that is being received. Something, you know, that has been buried for a long time is now at the surface. Somebody has received some sort of revelation in regards to which path that they should take. It's like it's no longer... A mystery. I, I see what path I should take. I need to follow my own path, my own heartfelt journey. You don't need to follow my heart. Somebody has found some strength and they've been given some strength. I mean, this is the angel of strength, so somebody has found some strength. They may need courage and confidence to go down this new path, you know, to follow their heart. Somebody may be finding the courage or they found the courage to follow their heart and search for the, you know, the missing piece. Ooh. Spirit, you know, is springing somebody into action. That's what's happening I feel as though somebody has been mentally exhausted and probably isolating themselves because they needed to heal, you know. There's been a lot of uh, I think self-deception. I think there's been some self-deception where somebody has deceived themselves holding on to something that, or, or thinking something that wasn't real, wasn't genuine, was. You know what I mean? Somebody what has been totally in denial over... Who, what, when, and where, you know? Not really wanting to believe the truth. But it looks to me as though the truth is now being accepted. That's what it looks like to me. Somebody has done a lot of healing. And now it feels as though there's a, a new feeling of acceptance. I mean, a new feeling of, you know, I understand, I see, I understand why this happened. I understand... Um, They've become enlightened. Somebody has been become enlightened with some sort of clarity, okay? And this clarity has been received through, you know, for one, through time. You know, I think somebody needed time to heal. They needed time to um, rest and rejuvenate you know what I mean there, there there's definitely a period of time where somebody has come to some sort of they've received an answer they've received the clarity they've received their clarity through time they've received healing with this clarity and now they're finding a new happiness within themselves self-love as well there's definitely some self-love here it's like I'm gonna take all the time I need to get back to where I need to be you know and I think while they were taking this time to be become, you know, and to figure out which which action to take, this person was um, 
realizing, realizing that they have to find the strength, they have to find the courage to go down a new path. And I feel like spirit has definitely been engaged here. I mean, with the door to spirit here, some, the spirit, you know, has guided somebody, absolutely guided somebody to healing, to happiness. And now we have a new door opening because somebody is basically seeing the light. After deceiving themselves for some time, after not wanting to believe that the wrong one wasn't the wrong one, you know. Now somebody has received received the, the, the message they, they see. They see that it's time to take action and head in a new direction. And they have been divinely guided to do so. So, and I feel as though, you know, it's finally time for that, that last curtain call. It's time for that last curtain call. It's like this curtain is about to be closed. The curtain, you know, what was behind that curtain? Lies, deceit, deception, trickery. Um, and it's about, it's about to be over with because somebody is deciding, you know what, I, I've healed. I want to be happy. I've, 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 I've seen the light. I've been enlightened. I've become more spiritual. I've, I've, uh, really woken up. Somebody has been through some sort of awakening. Okay. Yeah. Somebody has been through some sort of awakening and now it's like, you know, I love myself more than I ever did. I do. I love myself more than I ever did. And now I'm now, you know, it, it's it's time for me to to go even further, to take another step in a different direction. So I feel as though somebody is absolutely about to take action in a new direction. And it's away from the deceit. It's away from the deception. It's away from the lie. And they are finding the strength. They were, they've been given the strength and the confidence and the healing. I mean, this is, strength is healing. And we have, we have two healing cards. So somebody has done a lot, a lot of healing. And now, and now because they have woken up, they are going to find their perfect match. But it, you don't find your perfect match until you love yourself. And this is, this is self-love. So it feels like somebody is now able to open their heart, perhaps after, you know, not finding the strength to do so for quite some time because they had to heal, had to heal, you know. But it looks like the healing has really happened. Somebody has been through a, a, a great deal of healing and now they, you know, they're ready to open their heart. They're ready to open their heart after being deceived, after deceiving themselves. And because they're ready to open their heart, you know, I feel as though somebody is, is going to be right on their tail. You know, somebody is going to be right on their tail. I mean, you can't, you know, divine time. The time is now eights of power. So, so, you know, I feel as though there's some sort of change on the horizon that is about to happen because there's a completion of a cycle. Um, there is. There is. This is a 10. Okay. Fives are changed. We got a couple fives here. We have a change on the horizon because somebody has made a choice to allow themselves happiness now. I, I want love. I'm ready for love. I'm ready. I'm ready. And because somebody has taken the time they've allowed, they've surrendered per se, now, now the spirit is taking action, you know, and this, there's going to be some sort of opposites attract put it that way there is there's going to be some sort of opposites attract that come into play here but this person is this person that's coming in after you have healed because this is after somebody is healed there is no doubt about it after somebody has healed and they're ready for this love there's a new opportunity somebody is coming in yes i mean they're definitely it's your opposite it is your opposite but it's a perfect match so um, yeah, so there is definitely somebody coming in that is not you who you expect, but it's the missing piece. So I feel like today is a day of perhaps closing a door, closing the curtain to something that you may have lied to yourself about. You may have you know, not wanted to believe something. 
And perhaps today is the day where you say, you know what? It's time. It's time for me to close this curtain. Last curtain call here. I see the situation clearly. I mean, it's time for this change. It's time for me to make this choice. To go through that new door toward to happiness, to blessings. So I feel as though, I mean, somebody, and it, somebody has absolutely been divinely guided, okay? It's like somebody from above has, has helped somebody on this journey to healing. And the prayers, the answers, I mean, the prayers have been heard. The angels are around and they're helping somebody to move in a new direction and it's working. Whatever's happening, it's like true enlightenment and true healing has happened. Absolutely. Let's get some more cards here. We'll get some clarifiers. What is this deceit card? Who's been deceiving? I think that you guys have been deceiving yourself. Yeah, somebody's been in a one-sided situation, not getting any reciprocation, holding on to something. Somebody's been holding on to something that's not realistic. It's not balanced. It's not harmonious. This person's not giving anything, and somebody's been lying to themselves about it. Not getting what they deserve. Not, not receiving the, you know, missing piece. Ah, the devil ruled by ego, pride. But it looks like, it looks to me like this person is, turning their back on the pride, turning their back on the ego. Ready to face their demons, facing the demons. Somebody has held on to something for quite some time. And it wasn't love. It wasn't love. They only held on to it because of because of you could you could t you could touch it. It was comfortable. It was com maybe it was just companionship. Whatever it was, I don't know. Somebody held on to something that you can touch, but it wasn't love. And now they've received the clarity that there's a golden opportunity someplace else. Something's been hidden for quite some time. It really, seriously, something has been hidden. The truth has been hidden. Or not accepted, you know. Buried. Buried. Somebody buried their truth within them. Buried their true feelings. Buried their heart. Didn't want to open their heart. Didn't want to feel the pain, perhaps. I don't know. But it's time to dig it out. It's time to dig it out. It's time to dig out what you have, the pain that you have buried. It's time to stop blocking the truth and love yourself enough to say, you know what? I deserve happiness. I deserve love. So yeah, I think that's what's happened here. Somebody is being given the strength. The prayer, their prayers have been heard, and it's like the God, angels, whatever, is giving somebody the strength and the courage and the confidence to move in a new direction to take action the time is now destiny faded change of course free will plays a part so somebody is giving somebody the strength to take that step to close that chapter to close that curtain like I said this curtain's finally closing
Yep, we have a, we have a, a completion here, a major one. It's the end of one cycle. It is. One chapter of your life is closing and it's leading you towards something better. This is a card of purpose. Good fortune, good luck. Somebody some somebody is making a decision to change their course. And because they take action, because they, they allow it, they don't fight it, they're going to receive something really, really good. This is the reward. So we have a new beginning here. We do have a new beginning here because one chapter is finally closing. And they're bringing somebody in that is going to complete you a lot. I mean, really complete you. This person is not your usual type. But they are going to compliment you very, very, very well. So I feel as though today is a day of somebody taking that step to finally close that chapter of lies, deceit, deception, and head in a new direction. That's what I see. I mean, I can't, I can't change this. I'm going to get one more. I'm going to get Oracle card. A lot of healing here, a lot of self-love, a lot of um, spiritual guidance, awakening. Uh, it's like somebody has become a new person, all right? It's like I'm not. I'm, I've healed, I've healed, and happiness is all that matters now. I, I see, I see why, the, I see the purpose. Somebody sees the purpose, and, and it's just like... I'm ready. Oh my God. I just got done saying the time is now. I said the time is now, what, two minutes ago? I do that all the time. Answering the call, the time is now. I told you that. I actually made a big step. It's funny that this came out because I actually blocked a phone number this morning. This person can never call me. Well, if he took some extremes, he could. But, and I'm good. I'm good. So I don't know this, how this is going to resonate with the rest of you, but answering the call. I've blocked it. Blocked it from happening. The time is now. And the thing is, is that this is what needs to happen so that the, the universe has guided somebody to make, to close the curtain, you know, to cl close, stop lying to themselves. Answering the call. The time is now. You've been called. The sacred journey always starts with a call. You might feel ready, or you might be uncertain and not willing. But when you receive the call, you must respond. <laughs> if you've been waiting for your life to turn out, the waiting is over. Your true and authentic life is happening. If you've been hoping for a sign, this is it. Right now, you've been called, and a gateway is opening for communications from the spirit realms. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is summing up the whole reading. The energy of courage surrounds you. You may not know what the future brings, but you do know that it's now time to act and go forward. And that's what's going on here. That I just it sums up the whole reading. Spirit is trying to get your attention. <laughs> they do this for me all the time. Right now, your spirit helpers are telling you that this is your time. Listen with your heart. Oh my gosh, I, I totally pegged this one. Wow. Your time is now. Do it now. Throw your shoulders back. Take a deep breath and plunge forward. The waiting is over. The waiting is over. No matter what concerns or hesitations you may have, 
in the deepest sense, you are ready. Believe, trust, follow the signs. There will be many. And miracles will abound. Like I said, there's a reward. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. This, this totally confirmed that I made the right decision. This morning I got up. I don't know how this is going to resonate with the rest of you. I had I had a situation happen last night. I've been doing some cleaning. And I had something happen last night anyway. That reminded me of something. And I decided that I just need to block. I need to block. I need to block. And I feel totally at peace. I feel totally like I made the right decision. And I'm thrilled. I made the right call. Now it's your turn. I'm not going to pretend, and neither should you. I'm not going to lie to myself. I'm not going to stay in a one-sided situation. I'm not going to hang on to a one-sided situation. I took a... And you, I'm just using myself at this point, have done a lot of healing. You found your strength. You found your courage. You found your your uh, confidence. And you have a new vision of what is your perfect match. Your perfect match is not even the same perfect match that it was before. Self-love. This, this card summed it right up that I just read. Somebody is headed down a new path with confidence. And because they've, they're willing, they're willing to take that, answer that call and take that action, they have a new opportunity. Like I just said, I mean, the card just summed it up. Because somebody is using their free will and not blocking, we have a new opportunity coming in. Do what you gotta do. Good luck.